Hello Aquarius, thank you for clicking on my channel and welcome to the journey home. My name is Catherine and I live in Nova Scotia. This is your forecast for March. And we're going to begin with the Four of Air. The King of Air, that be you. The Queen of Fire. And the Seven of Fire. Seven of Earth. The Hanged Man. The Fool. Temptation. King of Fire. High Priestess. Nine of Water. And Strength. The first feelings I've gotten off this, um, Aquarius, is uh, is having your head turned where you need to be strong. It may also indicate here that there is a certain sense of callousness or being too harsh, being too unemotional, strict. There is a sense of admiration here for you. We also have the queen and the king of fire. So this feels like a bit of a, for those of you who are involved with someone, a bit of a division between you and a soulmate or a twin flame. Some of you have met the one. Some of you are about to meet the one. But there is a sense of confusion here for you in the month of March. Uh doing some withdrawal of healing, revealing, maybe revealing of self. This also makes, it looks like you need to be patient with yourself. Perhaps you've been hard on yourself lately. Perhaps you've been admonishing yourself saying, well, I could have done better or, oh, I'm so stupid. I get that feeling. But you need to stand your ground on your ethics. It does show that in the first month of March. Actually, you know, this almost looks like faking it till you make it. There's changes going on within you. That is allowing uh, fuel to the fire of your spirit, your aura. Spirit's advice here for you is to be patient with yourself. Spirit is working on you. Spirit is preparing you, Aquarius, for a big leap forward into the future. <sighs> Temptation. Uh, the temptation here may be to slide into a sharper tongue rather than compassion. But here is your reminder of that compassion. This person loves you, is passionate. <coughs> Has a lot of respect for your opinions, it seems. Now, it may feel that maybe um, maybe frustration is that this person is not moving as fast as you would like them. If you take away anything from this reading, Aquarius, for the month of March, you need to be patient with yourself. Um off-world spirit guides there things are unfolding things are coming towards you the law of attraction is strong here what you put out comes back to you this looks like a mild karmic challenge a very mild karmic challenge because things start to fall into place things become uh, more visible to you in understanding 
and a bit of a surprise here for you as well. There is a wish fulfillment. And you're showing a lot of strength when it comes to distractions. Let's clarify this message or expand it. Spirit, what does this message mean for Aquarius for the month of March? Let's try that again. What is the message for Aquarius in the month of March? Please clarify what the meanings. I want to keep that one. Recognition and reward. There's victory over this. Whatever is being unveiled is a victory. So it's not a matter of you know, unveiling deceptions here. It's about unveiling victorious truths. And look at that. Confirmation. Truth. Landing on the king of air. This is about being professional, doing it right. Yeah, professional rather than emotional. Movement, choices, decisions. This looks like it's landing on the Queen of Wands. This looks like aspected that you are making very, not just sound decisions, but determined decisions. Standing your ground, that is my decision. Making it for yourself. Solitude. This is all left brain thinking. And this feels more like a unity of balancing your left and right brain. I know that it's sometimes hard to turn that switch on and off. Work home, work home. But you're finding a balance as to when to shut, you know, flip the switch. This solitude, this really feels like that. Sitting down and being patient with yourself. Allowing, um, meditating even. Allowing those energies to come in and purify, wash over you, cleanse you from the day's activities or decisions that you've had to make. I don't see them as very difficult situations. Just necessary ones. And spirit wanting you to take time to relax. Be patient. Work on your throat chakra so that the words that come out of your mouth that are truth. Yes, truth can hurt. Try to maybe soften your words. Be patient with others. There is envy here. Aquarius, this feels like you trying to be patient with someone who is acting childish. But this also looks like a, a sense of retreat on your part in order to strategize how to deal with situations in March and people, patience, spirit, off-world, working with you, preparing you. When we come into full bloom, you'll be taking that leap of faith into this new area of vibration. Material and spiritual prosperity comes by beating whatever this temptation is. Well, you know, Aquarius, it may be that you want to jump prematurely. Maybe the temptation. And Spirit saying, wait a little bit longer. We're strategizing here. Allow it to unfold. It's coming to you. You just need to get in sync with you. Your left and right brain. Your throat chakra. Tempering your words with your heart. Look at this. Somebody loves you, feels passionate about you, is loyal, faithful. 
someone who will help pick up the slack when you need to take this break. Mental conflict. Is this have, does this have to do with you wanting to prematurely move? To be honest with you, Aquarius, that feels temporary. That There seems to be some type of anchor here, like, should I move on this now? And someone gives you this advice, probably this person here, that front speaking from their heart. Well, maybe wait a day. Sleep on it. Now, this mental conflict is actually the Two of Swords, which is needing to make a decision. The conflict is between logic and emotion. But we have the heart and the throat chakra here. So that when you are taking time alone, meditating, having some quiet time, you know, this will balance the left and right brain for you. Wish fulfillment where you thought there was heartache and loss. I'm sure you've all heard it before. These things of the past had to happen in order to open the way for your destiny, your path. What is interesting here with the three of hearts, heartache and loss? This is a healing card. That through this healing, wish fulfillment comes in. And we have positive, not only positive movement forward for you at the end of March, but powerful, strong movement forward for you at the end of March. Let's have a look here, Aquarius, at your love life and the advice that the angels may have for you. What is the message for Aquarius regarding love for the month of May? Message for Aquarius regarding love for the month of May. They want to say a lot. Give your relationship a chance. This is about finding your balance. It needs to be found within you in order to move forward with uh, your voice. You know. Balanced way of speaking truth. The situation involves marriage. Have you met the one you are going to spend your life with? Yes, this is your soulmate. Long term. And you were worth waiting for. This person feels you were worth waiting for. Open your heart. It is safe for you to love. This person is loyal, passionate. Ooh, lots of passion. Very strong magnetism here strong chemistry you go aquarius lovely message i hope that helped gives you some strength for the month ahead in how to deal with whatever situations may come your way thanks for joining me aquarius god bless you and i hope to talk to you again soon bye bye for now